hello again, people of Earth. I keep I keep saying that. It's like I'm an alien. But I'm not. I've just got red eyes of wind. Are you looking at me funny? Looking funny, no I do. I see. Anyway, me and my handlebar moustache have been very hard at work and, and and the first video was up and people like it. So it's good. But uh yeah, um there's a lot I left out last time because I didn't want to put loads in and be overwhelming because you know I'm nice. I give it you in small doses in case you have little tiny children. Then you can't handle me. But you can. I find the room perfect. Mm -hmm. Did a bit. Uh, so yeah, um, basically this video is going to be about, it's going to be sort of a bank video so we know where we're starting off from and I'll explain more about how I'm going to do it and Make, make it a bit more clearer. So here I am, I'm at the, the, the Grand Exchange. I do a wave. Hello. It's funny that, isn't it? When you wave, your your eyes stop being red. It's like you, it's like for a moment in time you're just a ah oh, ha oh, Ned Flanders. But yeah. Anyway, so yeah, uh, basically I'm gonna go for my s skills, my starting off skills, my bank, and stuff. And then it's going to be the same for most videos. And I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to start it off as a live commentary, and then it's going to go into uh, sort of voiced over of what I've been doing. So obviously I started the first video yesterday, so I've not had a lot. I'm not done a lot even, but I'll get into it. So my stats, firstly, 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 uh, we, we're already at 2,296 total. I did mention that. Um, with a few 99s, so they're all done. Like I say, the, the defense, cooking, wood cutting, prayer, fishing, and fire making. And yeah, they're done. So we don't have to worry about them. And yeah, so so far we're gonna, I'm gonna try and do it evenly because it'd be a bit boring if I just did one skill constantly until it was 99, and then moved on to another one. So. I'll do it as evenly as I can, so all I'm basically do is get everything to 70 and then 80 and 90 and so on. Uh, which means I'm going to introduce a new segment to my video. Which will be like the skill of the week, which is the one I'm gonna I'm gonna use these experience counters here. And what I'm basically gonna do is I'm gonna I'm going to find out how to clear them. Do I go into edit mode? No, maybe. Cancel. The cancel button doesn't work, Jagex. Interface settings. Ah yeah, experience counters, so. I'm always going to keep this the first one as a total level because that's been there since the beginning of my account, more or less. And the second one is going to be another total counter. And I'll click yes, and that will be the experience I gain in a week. Uh, so we'll, I'll a week I will start from a Sunday to a Sunday and so forth and the, the third one is always going to be my skin of the week um, which is probably I'm going to start with the, 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 the divination because that's the lowest one and it needs to be done so you can see as you see it's the bottom it's total experience well not, not completely total experience Wait, that's my total total experience um, the weeks total and the divination total so that's what we're going to do for that and every week we'll reset it we'll talk about it we'll it's like a book club i like this skill because it can be used as a hat mind my language and vices so yeah uh, these are my starting off skills um, i'm going to record every skill i get from now on to the end of the max thing unless i forget in which case I'll at least try and get a screenshot or something. So, 85 attack. I'm trying to get that to 90 at the minute because I want dry gore weapons. Um, which means I also need to make a bit of money for what, what, what? 10 mil? Let's call it 10 mil. And they're a lot of money each. Um, 78 smithing. Which... I suppose I'm going to get that one. That one's going to go to 80, I suppose. So that's the one once I get to 80. But I'm not going to do that until I get the divination to 70. 83 thieving, I quite like that skill, so that'll be 
fun. Uh, 98 magic, which is, I'm, I'm 149k away from that, so that'll probably be the next thing I get, if I'm honest. Uh, 86 farming, that's going to be a slower skill because I do like one farming run a day, even though you can fit two or three in. I usually do it just as I log on. And 57 divination, obviously, that's going to go to 71st, and then I'm probably going to abandon that for a long last time because it's the fucking worst skill ever. 97. Constitution, which is not Constitution, it's HP, and anyone who says differently is wrong. Uh, that's just going to come as it comes, really. And that's what I'm not sort of aiming towards that. Uh, 99 Defense and Cooking, they're done, obviously. 83 Fletching. Don't like Fletching, it takes too long. So, that's going to be a arse to get, really. Uh, 76 construction, I don't mind that too much, it's just the, the price of it is going to put me down a bit, so I'm probably going to have to have a bit of money before I get onto that, and it's the, the same with mining, it's not the price that time, it's the time. It's not the price that time, it's the time it would take to do it. Um, but you can get lava flow mine where you can just sit AFK and do that, so I'll probably do that. 86 herblo again, it's not one that I particularly mind, but it's going to cost, so I'll probably have to sell a kidney. 99 prayer and wood cutting is done. 94 hunter. Uh, I can finish that when I get round to it. 91 strength again. It's another one that will just come when it comes. Um, 99 fishing is done. 76 crafting. Uh, you can do that one of two ways. You can either do it the quick and expensive way or the, the cheap and cheerful way. And uh, probably because I'm lazy, going to make the money and do it the expensive way. Um, Rune crafting again. I'm just going to live in the rune span for a while and do that one, but I'll avoid that because it's a bit boring. Uh, summoning again. Don't mind that one. It's just going to take a while because I want. I need the charms, and I'm only 80, 88, not 86. Uh, 93 agility. I get a lot of um, experience from the circus barker guy, uh, and the daily challenge is sometimes the agility course, so that that'll help. 94 range. I get. Most of my levels have Queen Black Dragon and Water Fiends and uh, spent a lot of time in the Ascension Dungeon, so that'll probably come before long. 99 Fire Making is done, 91 Slayer again whenever I'm doing combat, uh, I do Slayer, so I'll probably finish all my combat before I get 99 Slayer. And 85 Dungeoneering is going to be, like I said, we're only going for 99 Dungeoneering in this series because it's only a max cape form. But yeah, that's my skills. We know where we stand. And the bank. Yeah, a bank video. I said I was going to show a bank, see where we started off. And I did try and sort it out. But here are my tabs. First one is crap, really. It's just stuff that I don't really know where it goes. I can't really decide whether it's worth getting rid of. Um, a fighter torso mm -hmm. from, from back in the day. Look at the graphics on that sword. That's terrible. I got all me, me um, the, the Gree Grease in case I feel like being a monkey. Uh, cannonballs mostly come from Squeal of Fortune. No one really uses a cannon anymore. Or I've not seen anyone use a cannon. And you don't go there, you go in there. Okay, and you go in there. Sorted. And effigies because I, I should do them because it's going to help with experience. Obviously, it's a road to max. I should use it. Uh, I might do that after the video actually. We'll see. Okay, so a second tab, oh, I'll do it this way. Is my you go in there? Push pushing. There we go. Um my capes and armour and things and a lot of the daft ones you see are for things like clue scrolls that just save me buying them so I keep them. And I've got my fire cape. Uh, I had two but I had to sacrifice one. So I could get the lovely Rhino Cape or Tokhar Cal, yeah. And I did that. I got my Veteran Cape because I'm over five years old, and all the, all the other skill capes that are there. And obviously this tab will grow in time as, as these do. And all my armor and things go in there. Um, I'm not going to price up everything I've got. I've got about 100 million stuff, but it's not that kind of bang video. Uh, food is just food, and you're in the wrong place. What are you doing? There? I can't eat you. Farming in herbalisms, I'm going to use because I want to upgrade to flasks, but there's no point in doing that until I 
done all the used all these, so I'll just do all that and then upgrade. So it's farming and potions and herb lore and things like that. Rune and magic, so I've got my staffs and my runes. Don't particularly have many of either. Um, a decent amount of earth, uh, green joker runes, joker, riddler, riddler runes. They should have been called riddler runes. Mining and smithing is in this one hither. Wood cutting and such, that's probably wood cutting and crafting that one is actually yeah. And finally my jewellery, which is just my basically all these pendants and things. And I'm getting to the point now where I've got one for just about every skill, so I've got these blank ones. But they'll probably go on divination when I can. And finally auras and rag and bone man bones there. You can hear the background, it's because the wind is open, so anyway, uh so yeah, like I say. The videos are going to be the case of, I'll start them off live, explain what I've done and stuff like that, and then I'll go into the live comment, no, 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 the voiceover, and take it from there, which is what I'm going to do now, so I shall not bid you farewell yet, but I shall be back. Okay, so we are back, um, like I say, this is the, the voiceover part of the, the video, where basically all this stuff I've recorded, it's stuff I've done on the road to my Maxcape. Um, this is Tears of Fix. for anyone who doesn't know what that is, it's basically a little mini game you can do once a week. And, oh, damn it. Just realised I had um, a weekly uh, distraction and diversions token that I'd never used, I should have just fucking used it on this. Uh, never mind. Uh, anyway, yeah, you do it once a week, um, basically you catch Gothix's Tears, and in the pole, in the bowl, and you get a certain amount of time to get as many as you can and the time is determined by your quest points um, and then the experience you get goes into your lowest skill so for someone like myself who's going for the uh, max cape uh, my lowest skill is obviously divination but they, they don't let you get experience through things like this at the beginning um, so this one's going to go towards construction I believe which does help because it means I don't have to do as much and then I did a bit of uh, divination um, this is me getting 56 I think yeah that's right 56 and then um, I stayed around a bit longer and got 57 <laughs> pardon me um, and then I had a daily challenge of like a boss which means I just have to go and kill a God Wars boss so I went and killed Bandos because he's the easiest um, <coughs> excuse me um, so yeah I went into the God Wars dungeon killed Bandos got the like a boss thing uh, which gives you a little, uh, it's a bit different to other daily challenges because it gives you a combat lamp and whereas the other ones give you um, sort of like a designated amount in whatever skill it is you're doing um, so that's what the difference is really so I did stay around for a bit longer and get a couple of kills in and I didn't get anything worth noting really so this is not really a bossing video, it's not a guide or anything but if you do have any questions about it, I'll answer it to the best of my ability, which is not great because I'm not a massive PVM. I mean, I'm still, I mean, I was, but at the minute I'm still getting used to the EOC and RuneScape 3 and things like that. So here's just a few kills I got from Bandos. And as you can see, um, they're not particularly exciting. I mean, I got a couple of coin drops and I was thinking about paying for the instance and doing the hard mode, but I thought after a little look at videos it just looks way too hard so I thought mm, there's no way I'm doing that right now um, so yeah stuck around because what, what the reason I stick, stuck around is because I'm trying to get 90 attacks so I can use dry goals I think I mentioned it earlier and it, it does help a little bit I mean it doesn't seem like you get a lot of experience when you're doing it but if you kill a boss you get more experience obviously I mean that's one four thousand or something right there so it does help. Uh, I think that might have been the last one I did. Uh, is there another one? There is another one! Here we go! Um, I did start to run out of food at this point as you can see because uh, I forgot to bring my unicorn or my little pony as I call it. And then so I finished my task, I went to the birth hole and traded in my um, thing and got my experience lamp. Um, is it a large one? I'm not sure. No, I just think it just says combat. Yeah, you know, on a challenge XP. And I use that in magic because I'm 98 magic and I think that leaves me 150k off 99, which will probably be the next thing I do. 
And uh, I did get a clue scroll as well from Bandos, so I thought I might as well do that. Uh, it's not really relevant towards the max cape, I suppose. I mean, it, it sort of could be. I, I could get money from it. And um, with that money, I could then buy skills, I suppose. Um, so yeah, this is sort of the first actual video. I mean, yesterday's was a bit of an introduction. Most of them will be, be between maybe 15, 20 minutes long, depending on how much footage I get, depending on how much I'd be playing. Um, I mean, it is something I'm taking quite seriously, and I do appreciate all the support I got on the first video. Um, so it'd be, it'd be cool if, um, yeah, you guys could show me some support, and I think it motivates me to do it more then. Which is always something I find I've needed in RuneScape, is motivation to play. Um, because th there are times where I just get bored and think, what am I doing this for? But if I'm doing it for a particular reason, then I can't really get bored. It makes me want to play more. I do love it when that happens as well, look, where you just get um, two clues that are the same. But then you're all prepared for them already. And so yeah, uh, completely, it shows how small my attention span is. I lose train of thought so quick. So yeah. What was I saying? Oh yeah, never mind. So yeah, um, I can also mention now that I've pretty much said everything that I do have another channel, it's Odd Sock Games, and that one is mainly for console gaming, so if you're interested in that and you like Let's Plays, um, yeah, subscribe to that, link's going to be in the description. And oh yeah, another thing I wanted to mention is, as I said, I'm not going to record 50 levels of me mining non-stop and things like that. Um, but I do live stream a lot on Twitch, so if you've got a Twitch account, um, I, the account there is called Oddsock Games. Um, so if you can, you follow that one, and yeah, I'll, do, I'll play a lot of RuneScape on there because uh, it, it's sort of another way of staying interactive. Because I can then, I mean, you can choose whether you want to watch the skilling or not. I mean, well, you can choose whether you want to watch this or not. But this is sort of just a here's what I've done and things like that. A summary if you like. Where am I going? I think I'm going to the Tree Gnome Village. And uh, yeah, I think that, that was another thing I was thinking as well. Um, I was constantly thinking like how could I do these videos and then I just remembered actually I can speed footage up so it's not that bad. And this is what I did. So I've been messing about with my software, learning how to use it. And yeah. So it's just the clues finished and that's this video done. I think this is the last clue actually where I go to Arandar or whatever it is. It is strange, like I say, it's a voiceover so I'm watching it rather than playing it. Because I'm just that vain. I watch myself play. this back to normal speed now? I can't remember. So yeah, uh, this is Rune Sock and I'm Odd Sock from Odd Sock Games, which is another channel, I did mention it. So yeah, uh, thanks for watching. I will talk really slowly so I can end at the same time, which is now bye